Your mother here tells me that you guys are having a little trouble conceiving. No, oh, no, 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 sweetie, no. no. Sarah is ready, so if your little guys are slow swimmers, maybe something can be done. Wow, Beatrice, I feel like I may have misled you because that is not an issue that we're having. Duncan, if you have a problem with erectile dysfunction, I can help you with that. Look, I just thought there might be a problem. Your father had a problem in that department, yeah, I don't, so I, I don't, just thought. I don't need to know about any of that. Well, honey, sometimes we have to hear things we don't want to hear. It's I'm... a common affliction, Duncan. A lot of men have it. Not me, of course. I'm a very virile man. Me neither. Very super virile. I don't know you well enough for this to feel comfortable with me. Bobby, thank you so much for this delicious food. If you want, Duncan, I can set up an examination. I don't. Mm, would you? I don't. Of course. Great idea. In fact, maybe I can take a look tonight while I'm here. That would be perfect. See if there's a response to a stimulus. Are you the one doing the stimulating? That's correct, yes. And size has nothing to do with it. Don't be bashful. He's right, you know? I mean, we don't have that problem. No. We have the opposite problem. I mean, we have to really take it slow. Honey, no one cares about the size of your willy. I've seen it, it's beautiful, it's way above average. The point is progeny. We want grandkids. In other words, there's more than one way to choke a chicken. Ah, uh, wow.